Gen Saga will be a playlist on this YouTube channel called called The Gen Saga with The Rise of the Goat and the F Star Wars The Final Battle. When I started writing the script of Star Wars The Final Battle, I really wanted something, something, something that would tie in with The Force Awakens. Um, something that, s s something that people would be amazed at on the very end of the last movie. The last movie is gonna hold a lot of things that tie in with Star Wars The Return of the Jedi and also tie in with Star Wars Force Awakens. It's gonna have a lot of stuff that ties in both of those timelines. But, there will also be some cool little features to the film. Like we'll have we'll have a lightsaber. We'll have two lightsabers. Two lightsaber battle fights. That'll be awesome. When I completed the Star Wars the Final Battle script in in uh, on December last year, 2020, I really wanted the script to end up in a good place. Just, I wanted the movie to end up in a good place. I didn't want, I didn't want it to look like the previous movie. With the previous movie script, Star Wars The Rise of the Goat, that I created, I was like really really confused on how this would end. I didn't want it to end with me just throwing the lightsaber behind me and forgetting the whole thing about Star Wars. I wanted this movie to go on with another movie. So that's why Star Wars The Final Battle came into my mind and I was like boom there we go so then we started writing the script and boom, there you go. But, I would say everyone will love this, will love the next movie, Star Wars The Final Battle. I have spent a total of about around 200 hours working on this film. This film will be will be the very very end of Star Wars The Rise of the Goat. It's gonna end it once and for all. It's gonna end and begin with Star Wars The Force Awakens. And um, it's not gonna complicate Star Wars The Force Awakens uh, timeline. It's gonna it's gonna play into it. It's gonna kind of open it up a little. And then um, you might be wondering, well, what started Star Wars: The Rise of the Goat? What started Star Wars: The Rise of the Goat? What came into my mind that wanted that made me want to create a Star Wars fan film? Well, pretty much anyone on YouTube can do it. It's not that hard. The thing that made me want to do Star Wars The Rise of the Goat was... One day I was bored and... Man, I wanted to watch a you know, Star Wars fan film. <laughs> so I came across one that really, really, like... I think it was called... Something... Jedi or something. Anyways, it was on YouTube. We, uh, I watched it, and I was like, whoa, I want to create something like that. So then, thoughts start coming in my mind about, hmm, wonder if I could bring Nibbles, the goat, into the fame film, and then my character. And so, we did that, and I 
started writing the script and um, came up with the name Jedi and uh, Darth Nibbles and um, boom, we got a fan film, got a fan film script. So then we started doing that and eventually I started really enjoying this and we got our camera and we started filming and uh, we started doing graphic design. 3D design, um, 3D animating, yeah, I really, really, really love doing visual effects, sound effects, and stuff like that. That was super cool to me. So then I started doing that, and it eventually ended up to becoming a fan film called Star Wars The Rise of the Goat.